Whitefish Bay senior Vlada Cod is saving up for college, so she advertised in the youth classifieds in Bay Leaves, the local direct mail magazine. Pet sitting, taking care of children like babysitting, and then tutoring. Her classified listed her mom's phone number, and in January, her mom took one very creepy call for Vlada. She just got this really weird voice, and like the hair on her neck just stood up. And her mom hung up. A short time later, the police called, asking if she'd gotten any strange responses to her classified. This person is actually doing this to a whole bunch of kids. Police tell 12 News that caller contacted at least seven of the numbers listed in the January classifieds and actually talked to three kids using sexually explicit language. Unfortunately, we have creepo people out there and uh, this was something we took very seriously. Best Version Media publishes Bay Leaves and about 10 other local magazines. Jonathan Strasberg says the January issue was the only time it's had trouble with the youth classifieds. Since then, it's made some changes. We, we blur them out for anything that we put online. Police determined the calls were made from a disposable phone purchased with cash in Arizona, but they've had no luck identifying a suspect. It makes you wonder if it's somebody that you know. Now, each issue of this magazine gets mailed to a couple hundred homes in Whitefish Bay. They do not appear on newsstands, uh, but they are posted online from time to time. And that, guys, is why they said they are now blurring the youth classifieds when they're posted. So, Colleen, this guy is still out there. What's next? Yeah, well, actually, Whitefish Bay tells us it has forwarded this case to Wisconsin's Department of Justice, where the Internet Crimes Against Children Unit is now investigating. All right, Colleen Henry reporting live in Whitefish Bay. Thanks, Colleen.